We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Welcome to New York. Wow, it's bright and early in New York. And Saint just wants to make the most of our time here. Yeah. <laughs> no, to be fair. Oh, let's turn the white noise off, shall we? Yeah. Sorry, if you guys, you guys are probably thinking, what's that in the background? What's wrong with our camera? Can we let go of mummy's hair? Thank you. The flight was honestly, I could not have asked for a per more perfect baby could be gone. He was honestly, like, not to toot my own horn, but I think I made a really perfect baby. He was as good as gold. He slept basically the whole flight, apart from an hour. <laughs> and I was actually kind of happy that he was up for an hour because it meant that he slept literally the whole time. It was down either side, wasn't it? Yeah. An hour from taking off, an hour landing. Yeah. So it's not a uh, flight, so it was a for six hours. But then it just meant that he slept the whole time going through, like... <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, bless you, it's all going on. Are we going to do another one? No, did you say? Nope. But yeah, then he slept through the whole of luggage collection, border control, etc. Which was good because it was a long queue. And actually, I don't know about anybody else, but getting through American security makes me really nervous. Does it make me nervous? It's just a bit like... The, guy, the security guard was called Cruz and he was like, it's a bit scary, wasn't he, Con? Did you see his name was Cruz? Yeah, that's cool, man. I thought that was a really cool name. I thought like he'd be in Hector's friendship group. Oh. Do you know what I mean? Not Saints then. Yeah, he'd be in Saints friendship group. Just, I feel like Herbie would be more friends with someone called like Donald or something. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Um. And then we got to the hotel. He slept for a little bit in the car ride on the way to the hotel. Went to sleep as soon as we got to the hotel. And he, we got to the hotel at like 11 p.m. Uh, New York time. And he slept through until about half past three. And then we've kind of been up, up on and off. We've kind of been able to doze off again. But then we just woke up to you laughing in your cot. So now we're wide awake. <laughs> Anyway, I actually don't even feel too bad, Con, do you? Considering I had him on me, like, the whole flight. So I didn't really get much sleep. I don't feel too bad. Oh, Ellie. Five more minutes. And it's like, five more minutes is a reason. It's like, no thanks, Dad. Huh? You're going up for a run around Central Park, aren't you, Saint? Oh. Getting up. Yeah. What about me? Yeah. He said that's what he's doing this morning. He's going to go and grab some donuts. Does anybody want one? Coffee run. <laughs> How are we looking? To about two hours sleep. Gorgeous bathroom. I can't wait to give you a um, proper room tour. Nice it's daylight and we're all awake. But yeah, loving the vibes in here. Primark pyjamas coming through. I actually can't believe we're actually in New York. Like, we just woke up in New York. I don't know about anybody else, if any of you guys have travelled recently, but it kind of, for me, didn't... I don't know if it's because I was really busy in the lead-up to New York, or because of COVID, or because I had Saint and maybe I was a little bit, like, anxious about, like, taking Saint away for the first time on the plane and stuff. 
It just didn't really feel real to me that we were actually going to come here. Um, obviously, they're changing like the COVID rules and stuff all the time. So, yeah, I don't know. I just, I didn't like get excited about being in New York. I didn't let myself get excited until pretty much we landed on the US. So, hang on, what am I saying? Toil? No, soil. I was going to say surface, soil. I've had no sleep. We let moments like this pass in the next couple of videos, guys. Okay, I'm mum now. So yeah, I just actually can't believe we're here. So I need to um, Google like things to do in New York. Because apparently this is the city that never sleeps. So what are some things to do in New York at 5am? Do you know what I do feel is like the new Google though for like if you're going places or you like want ideas to do? TikTok. It's not Google for me anymore, hun. It's actually TikTok. I'll just type in like hashtag New York, hashtag cookies in new york hashtag bakeries in new york hashtag things to do in new york hashtag christmas in new york i really want to take katie to see the plaza hotel at some point because she loves home alone so much and also want to take saint to go and see father christmas at macy's and i think there's a cute christmas um like a christmas village or um christmas market sorry guys my brain literally isn't working as you can probably tell and also the other final, well it's obviously not the final thing on my New York bucket list, so I want to do a lot more, but like these are things I'm really desperate to do. I don't know if this is like a thing, but I really, really want to just go to a street, like a like a normal street, not like a touristy street, just like a really cute street where loads of people live in New York. <laughs> and see their Christmas lights like and you feel like I've stepped into a, like a rom-com Christmas film do you know what I mean and just like walk down the street walk around the neighborhood so I'm gonna google that or tiktok but anyway I need to get ready first um do I bother with makeup today guys my my outfits right I've tried to really go out there for my outfit if you're not following me on Instagram please do because I'm really gonna try hard with this and my content okay but now I'm here, I'm kind of like, I wish I just brought all my Angel Collection tracksuits and leggings. And I, why did I even bother bringing my makeup bag? That's how I actually feel right now. Hello! Chewing on our favourite toy, we're having a teething moment, but we're ready for the day. First day in New York, we've gone for Canadian. Do you know what? I'm going to call this Canadian old man vibes, but you still look so cute. How adorable is this jumper from Next, guys? I feel like he looks like a little urban outfit, is kind of boy. Cool dude, you know? And then also, we've got the cutest hair to go with it. That Saint's head is getting on the little bit big, too big side for it, but that's okay. We've also got some mittens. We've got our brand new must have accessory, which is a bib, because he's teething so much. He dribbles loads. Um. And also, of course, he's quite refluxy still, so must have a bib. How's everyone feeling this morning? Really excited to go out. We're ready for the day. Hey, Kit Kat, show us your outfit. Whoa. Nice. New Yorker vibes. Love it. <laughs> Con, show us yours. Just plain Jane, mate. Nice. Ready to get some food. We're kind of, I know, so am I. I'm literally, yeah. so, I was so hungry through the night last night. My bay's about to rumble. Go close. Mm. Oh. Mm. Is there? Oh well. I feel like we're kind of matching today, Com. Do you reckon? Well, just with our jeans, really. Yeah. You know? Right, let's go then. Goodbye, everyone. So, surprise morning this morning. Oh, she's taking a picture of absolutely oh. everything. What are we taking a picture of over there? The first time in New York, you've got to take pictures, haven't you? What are you taking a picture of? Oh, this angle is unbelievable. What? Oh, love. Oh, nice pic. So, do you want to tell the angels where we are today? This so morning? We are at Ellen Stein, aren't we? Ellen Stardust yeah. Diner. If you guys haven't heard of Ellen Stardust Diner, it was literally on my bucket list to come here and bring Katie here. It's like apparently a really, really cool restaurant where they sing I've and dance. Heard of it. Oh my god, here we go. Okay. Waiting for some Okay. Here we go. Oh my god. Oh my god. I got you.
And Sam's gone for uh, the plain milk. The plain old milk. So, what are your thoughts on the Ellen Strada Steiner? They're having a bit of a break at the moment, guys, but we're very much enjoying the performance. I'll wait, I just sang. Yeah, he was so good. They're I'll all amazing. To You're going to give him a compliment? I'll, I'll sing like a job, mate. Yeah, yeah, I love that. So, they, they sang on the stage. We loved oh. your singing so much. <laughs> Appreciate it. Everything looking and tasting okay so far? Yeah, gorgeous. Thank you. If you need anything else, just let me know. Thank you very much. But yeah, they come and sing on this like runway down the middle of the tables and it's decorated for Christmas. They had grease lightning on when we first Yeah. Is it nice, sis? Little guy's fast asleep in his pram. And we are walking to Macy's. Oh, come there's a Chick-fil-A down there. Chick-fil-A down there. Another one of our faves. We'll We've not had. Oh my god, Con. The Chick fil A cookies. I've only just remembered how much I love them. No, Con, come on, the LA hike. Don't you remember doing the Chick fil A drive through? Oh, stop. Anyway, Con's just having his little sugary fix. If those peanut butter cup pancakes weren't enough, he wants Dunkin' Donuts. So I'm not quite sure. Are you getting a coffee? What are you getting? Coffee. And I'm getting a hot choc because Emily says, Emily actually got engaged in New York. How cute is that? Um, so I always think of her whenever I think of Dunkin' Donuts because when she got engaged, she came back and she was like, oh my God, if you ever go to New York, the Dunkin' Donuts hot chocolates are incredible. And I had one in London and she was like, no, 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 it needs to be in New York. So however many years ago that was, I think it was about four years ago, I've remembered it and I'm gonna get my first American Dunkin' Donuts hot chocolate. Like, you guys all know what I think. But yeah, he's asleep. Uh, we're walking to Macy's, that's what we're gonna do today. And we're gonna have a little bit of a shop, aren't we, today? A little bit of a look around in the shops. Yeah. There's so much I'd like to do though. I really wanna go to the Plaza Hotel, and I really wanna go to Central Park. And they're just like a couple of things I wanna to do today, guys. Uh, no, thank you very much. Merci. Cheers. 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 Kit Kat. Oh, Kit Kat, have I even checked in your outfit today? Yeah, you did a spin, didn't you? Yeah. But Kit Kat's having a beret moment. This is my first Dunkin' Donuts. Ever. This is my Ever. first Dunkin' Donuts. Oh, sugar, this might be mine. Cheers. Hang on. I'm struggling now. Cheers. Cheers, gang. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers to having a good family time in New York. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> How far will I go to not like coffee now I'm a mum? I just tried some of Connor's last... Wait, what have you got? Just a Dunkin' Donut iced coffee. Iced coffee and I actually quite like it. <sighs> I'm kind of like... How, what's the balance I'm going to get between needing energy versus taste buds? I've always been a very much taste buds orientated kind of gal. Now you need that caffeine. Now I need that caffeine. Food, so I, I need to kind of give way somewhere. Anyway, look where we've ended up, guys. We've ended up at Macy's. I literally cannot believe we didn't come here when we first came to New York a few years ago, Con. I actually it's find it crazy. Like, I didn't even think about No, to be honest, I like, I don't know what we did, Con. And here we are. Anyway, Katie's favourite thing as we're walking around is to tell me what movies were filmed where. So, what was filmed here, sis? So, The Miracle on 34th Street was filmed here, and it's got the Believe signs on Macy's, but it's not here anymore, so I'm not too sure. Well, we're on that. That's usually. Oh, can you stay at Macy's? Is it a hotel? That's usually here. No, oh, I hope it's not, otherwise, I would totally have booked Macy's Con. Oh, yes, sis, here it is. Look, the 34th Street, oh. West 34th Street sign. Oh, my God. 
Guys, I'm not being funny, but how much of a vibe is it being in America? A carnival? Why have you got the car Christmas carnival idea from? That's what the 34th Street's about, isn't it? They have a carnival go through. Why did you have that information? The movie? It's a movie here. Oh! Oh, look, guys. Oh, even the music. Oh yeah, that's oh that's Herbie, and this is Hecky. Oh, stomping his foot. Look at look at stomping his foot. <laughs> right here we go, gang. Making spirits bright. Oh, what fun! I sing a saying song tonight. Oh, jingle bells. Come on then, where's Father Christmas? Where's Father Christmas, guys? You know what I love? You just ask someone where we can see Santa. And they said it's the eighth floor, happy holidays. And I thought, you know what? I was just destined to be here. Wow, mum and dad are literally gutted. We're such failures. Oh, I, we literally are. Like, what mum and dad doesn't... Basically, Santa is here in Macy's. This whole thing is like a big thing to go and meet Santa Claus in Macy's. And there is no available slots the whole time we're here in New York. No, and I days. feel so sad about it. I say we just check every day and hope, hope. there's a cancellation or something. Hope. Do you know what, saying? If we can't meet Santa Claus in Macy's... We'll meet him in real life. We'll meet him in real life meet at real home. One. Meet the real one. Dad might have to pop out. Dad would, yeah. Dad but needs to pop out. Santa can come to our house. How about that? Guys. Okay, so we just booked tickets to go to the Empire State Building in like an hour's time and we've just decided to go for a little walk around the area and we found a dog park. And it's literally making me miss our big boys so much. Look, at, look, there's a little area over there for small dogs and then over here is where all the big dogs play. Oh, it's so sweet. Look, hi everyone. Come for my favorite kind of lunch. Literally, like 99 cent pizza slices from a random shop. Kit Kat has a sausage and pepperoni. We both went for chicken, bacon, and ranch sauce. And Colin and I got pepperoni to share. Garlic knots. Oh, it's just dreamy, right? Yeah, it is, yeah. Look at this. That's nice. Perfect Dr. Pepper. Wow. Are you having a great first day in New York, babes? Yeah, I am. Something about mum is really funny all of a sudden when you don't know what it is. Nom 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 n